Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I wanted to do a haul slash try on video of all the stuff I've been getting um, <clears throat> in preparation for going back to school. I'm probably going to go back um, late August. My school doesn't start back up till September 2nd, I believe, so I still have some time. Um, I've just been trying to get all my shopping in because it seems like we're going to be on another lockdown soon. So I am just trying to get in as much as I can. Um, so I kind of have been spending a lot of money. <laughs> um, but why not just share it with the world um, with what I've been getting. So I'll start with the things that I've gotten most recently. So I went to uh, two different Marshalls. Um, I live on the New Hampshire border, so I always go to New Hampshire so I don't have to pay sales tax. Um, and they have like so many like Marshalls and TJ Maxx's in the area, so I like to go all out. So what would back to school be without getting new candles? Um, I already have like five candles at my house at school. Um, but this one just looks so cute. Um, just as like a decor piece and it smells good. It's amber and bergamot. Um, it honestly just smells like a guy's cologne. I don't think it smells like amber or, or bergamot, but it's, it smells really good. So I picked that up. Um, so I have everything like laying down right there. The next thing I got are these, um, face scrubbers for face wash. I have these and I've had multiple, multiple of them. Oh my God. I'm like tripping my words right now. Um, but I like to replace them every few months just cause I feel like they get dirty and just like sitting in a wet shower. I feel like that just breathes bacteria. Um, and so the last non-clothing item, Marshall's has started to have their Halloween decor and I could not pass up on this Ouija blanket. It is so soft, perfect size. Oh, it is amazing. All of their Halloween stuff. They don't have a lot of stuff out right now. I mean, it's only uh, <clears throat> the beginning of August, but the stuff that they did have out for Halloween was really cute. I wanted all of it, um, but I just let myself get this one thing for right now because I have a lot of um, Halloween decor from last season, and I can already tell that um, as it gets closer to Halloween, I'll definitely be buying a lot of more stuff. So I had to uh, limit myself this time. The next and yes, okay, so the next thing I got from this specific Marshalls was this cute flowy dress. Um, there's not shape to it, which honestly I don't mind. I will say I look a little frumpy in it, but I'm not looking for a tight fit. I just think it's so cute and flowy. It definitely is a little short. After um, I show everything, I'll do like a try on portion. I just quickly tried this on after I got it but I'm going to a Salem soon and I needed something just like easy to throw on when I'm shopping so I got this um the next thing is this <sighs> like oversized um crew neck just as adidas I got a size large it's a men's large so I think It'll be <laughs> oversized on me, which I prefer. Um, super cute. I love the color, love the blue. And I also got this Red Sox hat because I loved the color. Um, it's a men's medium. I have a fat head. <laughs> um, okay, so next I went to the mall in New Hampshire because again, no sales tax. And the first place I went was Abercrombie. Um, I love their jeans. They are definitely pricey, but I think that they are really good quality, so I don't mind spending the money. Um, so these first, ooh, it's falling. These first jeans that I got, um, they were on sale. I want to say like thirty percent off, but they were still like expensive. <laughs> um, so we'll see how they look. I didn't try them on. I'm not even sure if the fitting rooms are open. I think they might be at Abercrombie. It's like a hit or miss with some stores, um, whether they have it open. These are the mom high rise in a size 25 short because I'm only 5'1". Um, so if these don't look amazing on me, honestly, I'll probably return them just because they were quite pricey. And I already have a bunch of jeans, like these aren't a necessity, but I always love buying jeans at the beginning of the season. 
And the next thing I got, this was on sale. Um, originally $20, I got it for $15. Just like a cute flowy shirt um, that I could wear to class. This would be me dressing up, so. Um, but I love their t-shirts. The material is always so soft and honestly not a bad price. So I got that. The next place I went was Garage. Um, I didn't get a bag from there because they cost money. Um, because you have to pay for like plastic bags. Uh, but the first thing I got was this cute crop top. Um, I got a size small. It's kind of shop like coming up white but it is like a beige color um I can wear this out when I go partying and stuff I originally saw this on TikTok that's why I wanted to go to the mall in the first place and then also um <clears throat> from oops wrong way garage I got this cute long sleeve top I love this blue um I honestly haven't shopped at garage in a long time just because I feel like their stuff kind of got ugly and just like the vibe that they had was just weird so um it, their stuff got cute again so I would definitely recommend going to your local garage if you have one in your area because they had a lot of cute um like going out tops um and then I believe this is the last of my stuff I still have other stuff I can show though. Um, so I went to Aerie, which, oh, I love this. This was 50% off, originally 40. Uh, I don't even know what I paid, 20, right? Paid like half off, um, but so cute. Um, I wanted it in a size medium, they didn't have any medium, so I got a size small, so it'll be more fitted than what I was hoping for um but i love all their t-shirts all their loungewear is literally all i wear like these pants are airy so um their stuff is always so cute and always on sale oh and then i also got from airy i got the famous crisscross leggings which were 30 percent off i believe um i've been wanting these for a while they keep keep have been out of stock um so i've had to wait for them and they finally came i want to give my um lulus a break because i wear them and wash them so often that they're starting to get gross so i just wanted to have a nice pair of these and i think the last thing i got is literally the top that i'm wearing i got it from target just as you can see <laughs> um i love this top i wear it all the time just because it's like an easy simple top to throw on that goes with anything so i like to replace it every once in a while just a size small um five dollars so that is it for stuff that i can think of right now um so i'm going to go and try everything out for you guys okay i'm back i'm um, doing the try on portion of this video so this is the dress um from marshall's i think um I just feel like it's a little short, but honestly, it's so cute, I don't even care. Um, I love this color, love this cut. Definitely happy that I ended up getting this. Show the back. Yeah, it'll be perfect just to like when I'm going out shopping and I don't want like tight fitting clothes. So I definitely love this one. Next is the um, Adidas crew neck from Marshalls. Like I said, I wanted it to be oversized. I think it's so cute. Um, just something to lounge in. It's really comfortable, really soft. And again, I got this in a men's large. Next, I have the um, stuff I got from Abercrombie. So this is the top, nice flowy material, simple back. And these are the um, jeans. So I really do like the fit of them, which I'm kind of mad because they are expensive, but I do really like them. So I think I'm gonna keep them um, and maybe try and get rid of like other jeans that I have because I just have so many. Um, but yeah, I, I, I like the jeans. Um, honestly, comment down below what you guys think because maybe I just think that I look good in them and I really don't. Um, I haven't taken the tags off yet. I won't be offended if you think that they look bad on me. I'm trying to show my whole body um so yeah let me know in the comments what you guys think because i'm bad at um knowing if things are cute or not so 
Next, I have um, the Abercrombie jean still, and this is the top from Garage. I love the ribbed material. I think it's really flattering. Just a plain back. Um, but yeah, this actually fits way better than I thought it would. It's super cute, and I'm excited to wear it. I am obsessed with this blue color. This is the second top from Garage. Both are size small. Still have the Abercrombie jeans on. Um, again, plain back. Um, I know it's kind of early to be wearing like long sleeves because it's not that um, cold yet, but having this in my arsenal of clothing for winter time, worth it. This top is so cute. I love it. So lastly, this is the airy clothes. This is the top. Um, I actually like the fit. It's not what I originally intended for, um, but I still think it's cute. And of course, these crisscross leggings I love. I forgot how much I loved um, airy leggings, so this like brought back my obsession with them. But that is all I have for you guys right now. Um, let me know if you thought the stuff was cute or ugly. I can take constructive criticism, uh, and I want to know your guys' opinions. So thank you for watching.